Hey y'all. Let me see if I can get this for you. Alright. That's better. I am here in Forum Park. New Jersey, trying out this new Greek spot. Um, Mediterranean food, Greek food. It is my one of my favorite cuisines to have. And um, I've actually, to save money, because food is... Cra the price of food right now, whether you're buying from the grocery store or if you're buying from a takeout, my, it, they match and it's outrageous. So I'm doing this thing off of Uber Eats where... You buy a meal and you get one free. So whatever promotion they're having, if it's a restaurant that I want to try or I fancy, I'm gonna go ahead and order from them instead of cooking and buying groceries and all that. Um, because it's just not making sense. So this popped up on my radar. It's called the Great Greek Mediterranean Grill. Um, it got you know pretty decent ratings. So I'm excited to really try the food. The promotion specifically was to buy one get one free gyro so i got a shrimp gyro because i love shrimp gyros um and baklava so and fries i got fries two gyros and baklava and the total was about 33 dollars yeah and a gyro typically runs like 25 20 to 25 dollars so i think that's a steal i have food for tomorrow and um yeah i don't have to spend that you know effort or time or money for that um so without further ado I'm about to walk in and see what it's about i'm so excited see y'all later Good, how are you? Good, thank you. I'm picking you up too. Oh my god, it's right here. Yay, thank you so much. Take care. I'm Happy excited. New you, Happy New Year. These are the feta fries. Oh, feta cheese. So I don't do dairy, but if I do cheese. It's got to be goat or feta cheese. And these feta fries look scrump the VM just look. Wow. Oh my gosh. The fries are pretty good. They're be definitely the best <clears throat> feta fries I've ever had. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm gonna give them. I'm gonna give them an 8.75, and simply because I'm having them a little colder, I guess. So the they're not as fresh. They're a little hardened. So I wonder how they taste like fresh out, and that might change the rating. Od. But aside from that, it's flavored deliciously. Um. Yeah, they knew what they was doing. All right, so I'm about to have the gyro right now. This is the gyro right here. It is a shrimp gyro. All the fillings in there. So I'm about to dig in. Here goes another. Mm -hmm. They did what they had to do with this. They did what they had to do with this. That's really good. The sauce is really good.
Great flavor. Not enough shrimp. Any more shrimp. I've only had one piece. I'm taking three big bites. And I see another piece coming. There might be just two pieces in here, but more shrimp definitely throughout the gyro, gyro. What makes this the best is the tzatziki. Like the sauce in here is made really well. Yeah, the shit hit. I'm running some more shrimp at the bottom. And it's doing its thing. My favorite has to be the raw onions, man. Should set it off. Last bite. Wow. I'm opening the baklava. And luckily I have a fork in the car. Which I think is hilarious. <laughs> but. Stay ready so you don't have to get ready. Mm, okay. I licked a little bit and it's all right let me show y'all before i bite into it what we work with here's the baklava crusty as per usual all right here goes the taste test ah here's the bite I like how easy it was for it to fall apart. I'm not sure what nut they use. It's probably walnuts, it looks like. And I feel like the quality of a baklava, or I don't want to say quality, but the taste depends on the nuts used. Also, the type of honey to use. So this isn't bad. Per se, I can eat it, but it's not the best that I've had. It's actually the out of the bunch, the worst that I've had. Still can't tell what nut this is. I want to say walnut. Let me hurry up and get out of these people parking lot. Now the gyro or gyro was, I would say, overall. Um. I would say eight, eight, eight over 10, just because I've had gyros with like more variety. But as for a traditional gyro, yeah, I did what it did. That sauce, that tzatziki sauce did what it needed to do. Um, And it, I mean, with the shrimp at the end, it made a lot of sense. So I give it a solid eight. And um, the baklava can get a nice 
5 out of 10. Yeah. Like I said, I'm going to finish it, but it's definitely the lower tier than I had before. I need some glue so they can part. <laughs> All right, so that's my review for the Great Greek Mediterranean Grill. I definitely will can't eat here again overall, but it has to be favorable. I drove about 20 minutes, 25, actually like 25 minutes to get here. And I have to drive back. So was, was it worth the drive? I say yeah. I wouldn't say it wasn't worth the drive. I say yeah. But I, would I make the drive again? No, I wouldn't. I would not. Um, unless I'm really craving Greek. Yeah. More to come. Great experience though. More to come. Yeah.